David, thank you, sir. A construction project turns deadly in Saudi Daisy. TDOT confirms a tractor trailer hit and killed a man who was working on the side of Highway 111. The truck was carrying coal. You can see that in this News Channel 9 sky cam that it spilled over all over the road there. Brittany Martin joins us now live. Brittany, have you learned any new tale, any new details on what led to this crash? Josh, yeah, so right now, of course, we know the road is back open, opened it back up about 30 minutes ago. And over behind me here, you can see that truck, that tractor trailer is still here. It's out of the way and the road's back open, but they still have it here waiting to tow it away at this time. And if we pan over this way, you can see the crew still on scene here. Uh, and those orange cones is where the accident happened earlier today. Uh, THP tells us that truck was coming down the mountain and that's when it all happened. A man working here on Highway 111 loses his life on the job. Using our News Channel 9 sky cam, we got a bird's eye view of the cleanup process. Sergeant Allen Bailey with the Tennessee Highway Patrol says the truck slid down the road here. At the bottom of the mountain, he started losing control and the truck flipped over and it hit a construction worker uh, that was standing outside of his vehicle. Sergeant Bailey says the man killed was contracted through the state to work on this TDOT roadway project. He says they had plenty of notice for drivers at a construction site was coming up like troopers with blue lights. There's only one lane of travel so the move over law was mute here but the important thing is you can see uh, uh, here at this area there's all kinds of signs and cones out uh, you know notifying the drivers there's a, a construction area. The driver of this truck was taken to the hospital. Sergeant Bailey says he will be charged in this crash. Now, Sergeant Bailey also gave us the name of the driver of this tractor trailer. His name's Jason Casada, 33 years old from Albany, Kentucky. And the company that uh, runs that tractor trailer is D&D &D Trucking, also from Albany, Kentucky. Reporting live in Hamilton County, Brittany Martin, News Channel 9.